it's, it's an eat or get eight mentality. You know what I mean? Uh, you know, either you're gonna line up against somebody and he's gonna he's gonna do you in, <laughs> and uh, you know make you look like a fool, or vice versa. So you choose one. It's a touchdown, USA, and it is Trojan Town once again. All right, Rosen fake to Jamabo. He's caught a lot of passes this half. Throw intercepted in the end zone by Tell. Tell brings it out. Marvell Tell with back-to-back -back outstanding plays. DBs have a unique mindset. Uh, I think they call it swag. As a DB, you know, we have the swagger. Uh, the confidence is key. Uh, shoot, we fall down one play, we get up the next. I'm not going to take it lightly on you, ever. Um, you have to have that confidence. You have to have that swag that they talk about uh, to be able to walk out on that field and know that you're going to be in man coverage and you have a job to do, uh, that you're going to have to cover a really good receiver uh, in man coverage about 80% of the time in the game. It's not, it's not so much a cocky type of swagger. It's more just, I'm confident that I'm going to lock you up right now. <laughs> that, that's, that's the mindset. And like we say, no fly zone for air marshals. <laughs> so tell me why USC. Man, it's where I feel like I fit, you know, for the next four years. Uh, I'll be happy, feel like I could be successful. I grew up watching Lindell White, all those guys. Uh, I remember one day I just got called into my counselor's office and uh, Coach Oldron with the, with the deep voice called me and extended the offer and I was, I was ecstatic. Called my parents right away. Um, I think in my heart, you know, I knew that was the, that was the right decision to go to SC. Well, I, you know, in, in recruiting Marvell coming out of high school, here was a guy that you just knew had a physical and mental maturity that was going to be able to contribute right off the bat. And that's so hard nowadays, especially at the college level, to be able to just step in and know a young man can contribute. And uh, Marvell was one of those guys. He came in with a unique focus, came in with great football instincts, a mental and physical maturity. That's how we do it. We're coming back next year for more. I'll be honest with you, and, and Marvell, who I am extremely proud of because, uh, you know, having the opportunity to come back for his fourth year was a decision that he made instantaneous, and it wasn't even based on football. It was based on getting his degree. Um, you know, he's part of our PPD program, which is a real estate development program here at USC. At a young age, my dad was in, in the real estate and, uh, business, um, so I kind of Got a few lessons from him early on and caught an interest early. Um, and honestly, I just love the, the the idea of owning land. Over the summer, this past summer, I had an internship with Bob Best over at uh, West Star Associates in uh, Costa Mesa, California, a little, little further south. Um, great opportunity, learned a lot from those guys and, you know, learning about the, the all the different sides of real estate. It's more than just, you know, selling homes and things like that. Uh, it's a lot to it, you know, a lot of jobs can be here one day and go on the next, but as long as we're alive and breathing, you know, this, this land should be here. <laughs> we're out here working this year. I mean, um, you know, we're not listening to any other talk, really. I mean, I, I love the chemistry we got. You know, we, we're just out here working, trying to get better every day, trying to get closer and closer to our goal, which is the national championship.